Yeah, you guys so announced this at a... Uh, so the high horse would control... Like, no, 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 no. When as the main controller, I think it won't be the main controller. Yeah, however, it's still... Okay. How do I get what I'm doing now? Oh, yeah. 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 You're one of the first to see it. going to have those four variable speed dosers on it that can operate from anywhere from 0.2 mils up to 100 mils a minute on a tridonic chip. So there can more heads and our internals. They're completely replaceable. Um, so that could be lanthanum or calc washer because it's a true stepper motor. It can be somewhat continuous duty as well. Okay. So we have the addition of those four on there. We also have the addition of the salinity probe using a much better applicable probe for what we try to do. So we use what's called a K10 factor probe. So the certification is much more appropriate for where our reef tank salinity sits. Um, on top of that, with this IV right here, you're gonna be able to isolate that salinity away with a probe inside of there and a pH probe inside of here. Okay. And so you can isolate that noise away. You can put that salinity probe in here. So every half hour, you can take an isolated sample of salinity, an isolated sample pH, and then on top of that, you can run an alkalinity test. So we use sulfuric acid and tritrate down off the known pH down. So we can do that test for extremely cheap. It comes out to about three cents a test. Now, when you buy that first piece of Hydro's control, you have all of the software. This device, when it's released, will release that software. So we're giving away the alkalinity testing software for free. This control has everything you need to facilitate that. It has the three dosing pumps, three out of four. It has a drive port for the stir, and it has a, a pH probe that you can stick in there. So that has everything you need.